I'm going fishing today. So today I am driving three and a half hours to go fishing. Um, it's a lake I've never been to. It's actually not even in Nebraska. It's in Iowa. I've never been here. My friend Ben and I are going. We're going to spend two days here. That's uh, it's Ben right there. What is up? We are we're going to catch some fish today. We're, yeah, like I said, we're going three, three and a half hours away. Lake I've never been to, like he's been to. When's the last time you've been there? June, post-spawn. June, so not yep. even, not even close to what we're about to, about to get to. We're just going to, we're just going to wing it. It is uh, about six o'clock. We'll be there about nine, nine thirty. All right, what should I bring? Except for it took a big one. It is 9.37 a.m. Left, left my house at like six. It's like three, three and a half hour drive. We're, we're, in, the, uh, we're in the water now, so we've got all day to fish, but we brought I brought basically every ounce of tackle that I have with me. So, in case the crankbait isn't fire, I'll, uh, I'll have some backup plans. But we're hoping to get a solid cranking, cranking fishing day in uh, in for today, and hopefully, hopefully catch a big one. Maybe, maybe even break my my PB. What are you starting out with? Uh, a, a, little, a lure. little cranker. I'm moving in. Moving in. That's a fish. One. Yep, that's a good oh, one too. Yeah. There we go, first yep. fish. That's a big one. That's, oh, a, to yeah. that's a toad, you got her? I'll get her. All right. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Screwed up. Dude. Yeah, buddy, look at that. I on that thing. Dude. <laughs> first, oh dude, look at the tail down its mouth. I don't know if you guys can see that. There's a giant shad in its mouth, but uh. There's a little, little beauty there. First, uh, first fish, right there. A dead goat stud. How fat that thing is, dude. We got a 4.76, almost a five. All right, we got a, about a five pounder. There she goes. A big one. What was his name? Oh, I didn't name that one. Oh, come on. What should I name it? I can still name it. It's not too late. Um, Betty? Big Betty. She has Big Betty. We gotta catch some more Big Bettys. You guys ever go to Coffee County in Kansas? Yeah, he has. I've never been there. I kind of want to. I kind of want to go there. Like, there's oh, one. Oh God! Dude, gosh, that's a big one. That's a big one. Oh my gosh, that's a toe, dude. Oh. Get him out of here. Woo! It's shrinking. Oh yeah, it is shrinking. It's oh wow. Did anyone else think that was? Yeah, it look, looked like. Look at that. Okay, that's not just me. He got the God. net. He got the net and just caught this like. It was huge. It sounded huge. That literally, I thought that was like an eight pounder. <laughs> Ooh. Well, that ain't the one that bit it. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think it came off and his buddy ate it. That's nuts. He's like maybe two and a half, three pounder. That's so funny. And there's the uh, second fish. What are we naming this one? All right, this is uh, this is Joe. See you, Joe. All right, well, there's a uh, little, little Joe, not Big Joe. Second fish. I mean, I thought it was like for sure my PB. It's like a nine pounder. Yeah, nine pounder. If that would have came off, I definitely would have said I lost my PB. So, I guess it's kind of, I guess it's kind of good that it didn't come off. But we're catching fish. I don't know how much water's um, changed that whole thing. Are we going to do a point? Is that what we're doing? Okay. Alright, so uh, we've got two fish in about, I don't know, an hour, hour, two hour, I don't know. I don't know how long we've been here. What's that? I lost one. You lost one? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I've caught two. He's lost one. 
and uh, we're making a move. We're basically just fishing like rock, rock jetty, rock points, and we're gonna head across the lake and uh, try to catch some more fish. I'm catching them on the chatterbait. They're throwing crankbaits. Not really sure which one's gonna work out work out better, but we're just we're looking for some big juicy chicks right now. Megan? No. Oh, we got, is that first crankbait fish of the day? I, I got a uh, white. White. You got whitey? Skirt. Got a little white. A little white. Well, that's the first uh, crankbait fish. White Not the white. right species. <laughs> it's deeper here because the way it is. It's the it's not 14 right there. There's one. It's straight up still. Oh, we got a big one. Oh, God. Got a big one. Giant. It's actually a good that's sized good one. Light. That's a good sized one. Eat him. That's what we're having for dinner. Call Rachel. Dinner. Nice. Look at that. It's a, so it's a hybrid or do you think it's a white? Let me see it. It's a, probably a hybrid. A hybrid? So it's kind of a smaller hybrid, but Peeper. that's the first, uh, it's first like hybrid I've probably caught. Hey buddy. Oh, oh, right at the boat. That's big. Oh my gosh. That's my got him. Woo! God, that is a white. Oh snap, I don't know who's got who. That smacked it right at the boat. Well, this is kind of fun. Dead gum stood white! <laughs> <laughs> oh god, he's big. Well, we got another uh, hybrid or white bass. One of the two. Probably a hybrid. That's gotta be a hybrid. Yeah. Longer. Yeah. They're sure fun. Not, not the right species, but uh, we found them, so we should probably drop the poles. Drop the poles, we're on them. <laughs> on them at the fire pond, too. Why was that big oh, one? Oh, we got, you got another That's one? That's a big one. Oh, it's dead gold. What, what is that? White? white. It's a dead gold white. Man. You got a white? Look at that. Oh. Oh, did that go through? Hawk snatcher. <laughs> did that go through? That's yeah, in. No. Oh God, no. <laughs> Those oh. six cents hooks are good. Oh, That's dude. That's past the barb too. Oh, I can't even watch. You wanna see something cool? I can't watch. You gonna, you gonna try to get it out? No, I'm gonna pull it out like a man. Oh, okay. Just grab onto it like this. <laughs> oh, no. no, dude, that color is so good. <laughs> You go like this. <laughs> oh my god. I'm like I'm like getting like lightheaded just watching that. Okay. I would not recommend that tactic <laughs> for anyone that just watched that. I would not recommend I that. Actually do it, Kevin Van Dan. <laughs> Amateur. That is that is one way to do it. Not recommended. Alright, we're uh, we're gonna go back to fishing. Go. Got him? Yeah. Oh we got him. That was like the second cast on that crank. Yeah, it's the he five. Changed up the crank. What do we got? We got a largey? Oh, we found a large mouth. Maybe. Crankbait fish. Got it. Maybe I can put down this chatterbait. And Jesus, actually catch you're a fish. not catching anything. Get rid of that. I like to give tips in my videos, so normally whenever you're fishing, you want to make sure there's a uh, big leaves like this in the water. It's if you can find that, that's better than any cover, any rocks or the, any brush piles that you can shade. find. It's uh yeah, it's it's mobile mobile shade. You just gotta cast right on the leaf, and and they'll uh they'll be right under it. Just giving you guys <laughs> just giving you guys a couple tips here. Back there, straight forward. That's the quarry back there. It cuts back all the way around. There's one off of the backlash. Off the backlash, boys. Get in here, boy. See, you guys always see me getting backlashes, thinking I don't know what I'm doing. You gotta get a backlash. You gotta give the uh, nice, subtle presentation of the chatterbait sitting on the sitting on the bottom, and then uh, that's uh, until you until you catch that guy. All right, see you, Fred. There's one. There's one. Oh, my hat came off, but I got a fish. Oh! 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 I just got me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so much for that fish. I just net white. It was going straight sideways. Yeah, just uh, smacked Ben with my old chatterbait. Pulled a John B and hit someone with the lure. 
I've got one. Oh god. I gotta come over here. Dude, it's a big one. Yeah, saw that. Yeah, it's a big one. Oh gosh, it's actually it's actually big. Oh my oh gosh, he's still there. Thought he came off. Oh. Oh my gosh, it's giant. Large <laughs> one. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's wrapping around my hand. Got it, he's out of fucking control. He's dead now. Yeah. Killed him. Woo! That'll do. He's hooked in the Right in the nose. Well, it just about does that. That's a good fish. I thought I thought it was much bigger. Why do these fish all of a sudden seem massive? And then they like it's not just me overacting. It's that I thought this thing was like six. Four pounder. Yeah, it's probably right, probably right at four pounds. We'll call you Bessie. Not quite a not quite a what? Not quite a Betty? Not quite a Bertha. Okay. She goes. We found them. Drop the poles. It is uh, 2:40 in the afternoon, so that means we fished three, four, five hours, six hours, five hours, six hours, and actually had a pretty good day on the water. Caught almost a five pounder and then probably close to about a four pounder and a couple twos maybe a three here and there but i kind of wanted to go over a little bit what we were doing um it was kind of a hit or miss pattern i mean they i found the lure that they wanted they weren't really like stacked up anywhere all we were really fishing was like wind blown jetties and that's really the only thing to fish in this lake so we didn't have a choice but there was like one fish per jetty that we kind of figured out like just how to throw the right lure which in this case was a white new tech crazy jig and uh the little white swim bait on it and if you guys want any of the products like the rod the reel the line the lures you guys know all that stuff will be down in the description so i don't want to take up time going over any of that uh, but as far as our tactic goes i think the fish were just kind of sluggish today we don't really know why they weren't super active uh ben and joe they were throwing square bills and flat sided crankbaits like this uh little six cents one right there and they caught a couple fish but they weren't eating it like they like they were eating the bladed jig that i was throwing at one time in particular where i had a backlash and i was picking it out and it was that my chatterbait was probably sitting on the bottom of the of the lake in the rocks for probably 20 seconds and i picked it up and caught a fish so that just kind of goes to show how slow the fish were moving they really just wanted that slowly crawling and stuff like that so if any of you guys are fishing on a lake um anything in particular that has like wind blown rocks and you're not catching them on really fast reaction baits then uh try slowing down to something like a chatterbait where you just kind of crawl it along um we could probably could have thrown a jig or a shaky head and probably caught some fish but we we really just wanted to get a reaction or action bite going mainly on crankbaits which i ended up not even throwing one because i caught a five pounder on a on a chatterbait uh, relatively quickly so without any, taking any more of your guys' time that's essentially what we were doing is just fishing wind blown rocky points with chatterbaits and crankbaits that's all i've got we are going to go pond fishing but i'm gonna make that separate video because because lake fishing is different than pond fishing and so i want to i want to separate these two so if you're watching this video within like a day or two, you should see a pond fishing video if it goes well. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get eat food and then we're gonna go pond fishing. And then tomorrow we're getting up and we're gonna do some more lake fishing. So hopefully get three videos out this weekend. But that's all I got. Fire pond. Yeah, we're going to fire pond. Peace.